Happy Christmas Eve everyone and welcome to the Philippines! So I'm here in Tundo, I arrived last night with Tal. How epic is this view? I've got a 360 view of Manila. I'm staying at an epic Airbnb right now. If you want to stay in this area too, the Airbnb description is in the link below. Um, very exciting plans today, very very exciting Christmas plans, Christmas Eve plans. I'm not going to tell you exactly what's happening today, but all I can say is we're going to make a lot of Filipino people very excited, very happy, and they have no idea what is coming. So, <laughs> get ready people, because this Christmas is about to get wild, yeah yeah! transportation and we are back in a truck it has been so long since I've been on a truck these are like the main transportations around Philippines and you'll be seeing these everywhere oh my god this there, there is there is no limitations to how many people you can fit in these it's like as much as you can jam in that's as much as you can fit so let's go Yeah, so before we jump into any of our crazy plans for today, we're gonna get some food because I'm extremely hungry and I'm gonna introduce you to someone. You've probably seen him before. We've got Ivan and Brooke. So hey. I met up with these guys at Tuk Tuk Rental. They actually worked at Tuk Tuk Rental and they're here now in the Philippines. But you gotta get some of this. Alright, what is it? Oh, you got some? Quack quack, it's like the most popular quack, quack. Filipino street food. It's just a deep fried egg. Deep fried egg? And it's so good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, we'll try some of this. Sounds I good. I love a bit of Filipino street food. Oh, there's a It is busy around here during Christmas Eve. So, I'll let you guys know what our plans are for today is. Oh, I don't want to get lost here. So plans are, that town that I was in, in Tundo, we are going to buy a bunch of presents and buy a bunch of little gifts. And we're going to head down that Tundo street and just hand out gifts to heaps of kids. And if, I don't know if it's going to happen or not, but if I can find a Santa suit, I'm going to dress up as Santa Claus while handing out gifts. Kids are going to go crazy. I do not know what to expect. It's going to be absolutely insane. And to top it off, to top it off people, we're even going to buy a bunch of dinner. Like, we're just going to go all out for a Christmas dinner and just rock up to a family that um, one of Tyler's friends has organised. So they have no idea that we're coming and they have no plans of having any Christmas dinner, but we're gonna rock up and just surprise them. Whoa, this is insane. Look at these people here. Somebody has like shivers. One's got like a crunchy shell. Yeah, yeah, the same thing with... Okay, so Tal introduced me into this food. Banana Q. This is called Banana Q. And what is it? Is that, what is this stuff around it, actually? Like, what's brown the, sugar. Uh, it's brown sugar. Yeah. Brown so, sugar and banana. Just brown sugar and banana. Sounds and simple, magic. but what is it like? <laughs> it's the magic. And the magic, yes it is. Oh my god. Love. That is amazing. 20% sweat. Like, it tastes yeah. like caramelized. <laughs> it's so good. It's so simple, but so good. We haven't even been shopping for that long. Everybody's in a Santa costume. It's gonna happen, guys. It's happening. We bought a Santa costume. And I'm getting in that later today. And then our presents to kids in the slum. Uh, it's gonna happen. It's really gonna happen now. Alright, so we're about to head into the Divisino Mall. So, if you don't know this already, Filipinos love their malls. Like, 
when I first come to the Philippines, there is malls everywhere. Like every big city you go to, there is huge malls, the biggest malls I've ever seen. And whatever you want, you'll be able to find at these malls. We're looking right now, let's like, try to find something that we can find in bulk, you know? Look at this picture, you're gonna love this. Uh-huh. Cars? Cars. How much is it? 400? 100. How many is in there? For the whole thing. <laughs> oh yeah! So this shop is extremely tight. It definitely doesn't look like we're low on toys around here. Like everything here, you buy bulk. Like I, I don't think you'd actually buy some. Hey, I don't think you'd actually buy anything singly here. You can all buy bulk, and which is perfect for us. But another thing we need to find is a big sack. It's all like a Santa sack to put everything in. So if we can find a big giant bag that we can put all these toys in, that'd be good too. There we go. <laughs> I haven't found a sack. So I should do right. Literally just found it in this pile here. Nice. That is huge. We'll be able to fit so many presents in that. <laughs> With the amount of gifts we're going to get, that is just going to be too much. Okay, so we hit one jackpot at the moment. So they got like so many bags of different little toys around here. And they do it by the weight. So we're just currently weighing up like a few different toys. And these would be like good little ones to hand out. How many for two? Okay, we're gonna bring it here. Right right, more gifts, more gifts. Put her in the bag. 120 candy eggs. Damn, that's a lot. In the bag, in the bag. All right, filling it up now, slowly filling up. <laughs> so it seems like we're all sorted for the presents we're gonna give out along the street tonight. So it's a pretty big bag, we got, we got a fair bit there. <laughs> and we're just currently gonna find some more like bigger presents for the, we're gonna be staying with two families. So we're gonna visit two families tonight to celebrate a Christmas dinner. Um, so and we're gonna see if we can find some bigger presents for the kids in these families as well. And with every Santa, of course, there's gotta be Santa's helpers, the elves. <laughs> so we're gonna buy a few elf hats as well for everyone else joining along. Along this whole street, it just sounds like there's fireworks going off. But all it is, is these guys just making noises with tablecloths. Look at that. What the hell? <laughs> interesting food so they got like a very sour mango on a stick and they put shrimp paste on it look at it and I think it's is it salt or salt or sugar they sprinkle on it salt and they sprinkle salt it's good you like it <laughs> Merry Christmas Merry Christmas it seems like it's a whole day of just trying new things today they're walking along the street there's way too many temptations I got this little ice pot here so it's called a ube it's also it's kind of like a sweet potato flavor and it's got cheese inside, like little chunks of cheese. Oh wow. Look really nice. Ube ice cream, baby. Ube ice cream. That is super creamy. Mm. Damn, I'm loving the food around here. Alright, shop number two, present hunt, huh? let's do this. So we're not allowed to walk into the shops with our bags, so we just got to deposit our, um, our Santa Claus bag because it's a bit too big. <laughs> right, we thought it was just like a bunch of people like getting items around here, but the counter is all the way down there. This is one big line like, <laughs> through this whole entire shop. There's like probably a hundred people in that lineup. We're gonna move shops. Alright, so there's a very interesting drink. It's, it's, it's in a ginormous pot at the moment. Um, it said it tastes like vanilla. Oh wow, it smells really nice. Of course, every few meters we go, we're getting something new. So we got this, it's called Gulama, like Gulama liquid, Gulama juice. And it, it's really, really sweet. Really, extremely sweet. But it just tastes like sugar syrup. Right. Very interesting transportation throughout the Philippines is these things. These are called GP. I don't, I feel like you can only see these things in the Philippines. They, they are an old army truck and 
you more see them around like the cities throughout from, uh, the Philippines, but it is a super cheap, cheap way to get around. So the power around here looks pretty safe. <laughs> it's just it's like spaghetti power lines throughout the whole city. All right, so we're here at Happy Goldilocks and we're ready to pick out a delicious Christmas cake. And it sure looks like we've got a wide variety of amazing cakes to choose from. Ooh, yummy. Oh, damn, look at this cake. We got a Merry Christmas. Oh, that looks delicious. Merry Christmas to you, too, His family's gonna love it. <laughs> so we've almost got everything sorted. We got the cakes. We've got the presents. We've got the costumes. Just one last thing we gotta organize is the dinner, is the food. So we're gonna be heading to a place right now and we're pretty much just gonna pre-order the food. So we're gonna pre-order it and get it sent to the house later tonight. Ooh, it's all coming up so close. All right, so we're here at Paluto. This is the place where we're gonna be ordering the dinner for tonight. And we just decided to have lunch here as well. So this is an amazing meal. We got curry curry with oxtail. We got rice, we got fried chicken, and we got some intestines. Mm, yeah, yeah, dig in. All right, has anyone else come with us? Hi guys. <laughs> Alright, that's it. So we got everything we needed for today and all we have to do now is wait. So we're probably going to hit the streets uh, with everyone else kind of later towards the night because it just gets busier later in the night. And come check out our presents we got. So we got a lot of gifts here. It's a, it's a lot of things we can give out as well. Like just big bulk things. It kind of feels bad like having to buy this much plastic in a way. But yeah, I'm sure we're gonna make a lot of kids happy. And I am sure I am going to have the biggest swarm of kids around me. Being in a Santa costume, bit, like, I didn't even, I just have to be white walking on the street and I would get a big swarm of kids around me. It's crazy, but this is going to be so amazing. And I'm gonna leave this as a cliffhanger because I have enough footage for a video right now. So you guys are going to have to watch a next video to see me hand out these presents and to see us celebrate Christmas with a Filipino family and supply them dinner. So it's, I really don't know what I'm in for guys. I have no idea what I'm in for. And then after all that, tonight apparently there is a huge party in the street. Tull told me that around midnight, 1am, like it just kicks off massive. It's... I don't know what I'm in for, it's gonna be insane, but all I know it is gonna be a fun time celebrating Christmas Eve here in the Philippines. So be sure to watch the next video guys, don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you then, bye!